Welcome back, Hack Pack, to the Mark Janot Show, your home for hacking news and education. Today, I'm going to go over nine best uh, commands that hackers use that you need to know as well. Number, uh, number nine, we have task list. Task list. This command opens up an entire task manager on the command prompt. Users need to enter the task list on command. And they will see the list of all running processes. You can figure out all the wrong things with these commands. Moreover, you can also use the command to close any processes forcefully. Number eight, net view. This command displays the list of resources, computers, or domains shared by the specified computer. On Windows, you can use the net view command to find computers in your network whose network discovery is turned on. Number seven, route. It is a command to view and manipulate the IP routing table in the Microsoft Windows operating system. This command will show you the routing table, metric, and interface. Hackers often use the route command to distinguish between routes to host and routes to network. Number six, net stat. If you want to find out who's establishing a connection with your computer, you might try to, um, uh, typing in the command prompt net stat with the space and then line A, sorry. <laughs> it will display all the contacts and learn about the active links and listening ports. Number five, IP config. This is the command which shows every helpful thing. It will show you the IPv6 address, temporary IPv6 address, IPv4 address, subnet, ma subnet mask, default gateway, and other things you want to know about your network settings. Number four, ARP. This command helps you to modify the ARP cache. You can run the ARP A command on each computer to see whether the computers have the correct MAC address listed to ping each other to succeed on the same subnet. Uh, number three, trace art. You can say trace route like its name. It allows the users to trace an IP's route to uh, reach a destination. The command calculates and displays the time each hop took to reach a destination. You need to type tracert uh, x, 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 dot x, dot blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Number two, NS lookup. It is a network administration command line tool that helps you obtain domain name or IP address mapping for any specified DNS record. The NS lookup is often used for obtaining the server records. Suppose you have a website URL, but want to know its IP address. You can type in command NS lookup, which, you know, like Google, and replace google.com with the website URL of which you want to find the IP address. Last but not least, this is number one, and it is ping. This command uses your internet connection to send some packets of data to a specified web address. Then these packets are sent back to uh, your PC. This test shows the time it took to reach the particular address. Simply put, it helps you know if the host you are pinging is alive. You can use the ping command to verify that the host computer can connect to the TCP slash IP network and its resources. For example, you can type in the command prompt ping 8.8.8.8, .8 .8, which belongs to Google. You can replace 8.8.8.8 .8 .8 .8 .8 with www.google.com or something else you want to ping. Did I leave any command out? Please let me know. I want to know your opinion. Stay safe. See you on the next video.